All right, Sam's apprenticeship, uh, 2021 Florida registered, registered by Florida Department of Education Division Career Adult Education Apprenticeship Section, revised July 23rd, June 23. Definitions, conformity, state, federal laws, registration, apprenticeship program, section one program, administration, apprenticeship committee, section two, um, section two, responsibility of the apprentice, section three, funding, section four, maintenance of the apprenticeship record, section five, Amendment modification, section 6, notification, section 7, program cancellation, deregistration, section 8, adjusting differences, section 9, supervision, apprenticeship, hour, and hours of work, section 10, assurance qualified training personnel, section 11, apprenticeship agreement, section 12, credit previous experience, section 13, safety, health, and tra training. Section 4, Transfer Apprenticeship to Training Obligations. Section 15, Certificate of Completion of the Apprenticeship Program. Uh, Section 16, Term and Apprenticeship Training Approach. Section 17, Probational Period. Section 18, Ratio of Apprentice. Section 19, Qualification Selection Procedures. Section 20, Affirmative Action Equal Opportunity Pledge. Section 21, Work Process Related Technical Instruction. Section 22, Apprenticeship Weight Schedule. Section 23, Participating employer, official adoption, apprenticeship standards with committee, official adoption, apprenticeship standards without committee. All right, definitions. All right, apprentice means a person at least 16 years of age who has entered with the apprenticeship agreement with a registered apprenticeship program, sponsors engaged in learning, apprenticeship occupation through actual work experience, supervision of journey workers, 6A23-0022, fellow administration codes. Two, apprenticeship agreement means a written agreement between the apprenticeship of the participating employer of the, or apprenticeship committee acting as an agent participating employer which contain with the term of the condition of the employment and training of the apprenticeship 6823-0023 Florida Administration Codes. Apprenticeship committee means those of the person designated by the sponsor and administrator of the program. A committee may either be joint or not joint. 6A23-0024 Florida Administration Codes Apprenticeship Program means a plan containing all the terms, conditions, qualification, recruitment, selection, employment, training, and apprenticeship. Plan training of apprentices, including such matters as the requirement of a written apprenticeship agreement, 6A23-0025 Florida Administration Codes Apprenticeship Standards. Standards of apprenticeship means the minimum requirements established for the, each of the uh, apprenticeship occupation under the apprenticeship program administered. 6A23-0227 Florida Administration Codes. 6. Apprenticeship training representative means an individual representative of the Florida Department of Education properly authorized to act on the behalf of the department in matters concerning registered apprenticeship pre-apprenticeship 6A23-0026 Florida Administration Code. Department means the Florida Department of Education with registration agency of her federal apprenticeship purposes, 6A23-0011 Florida Administration Codes. 8. Journey worker means a person working with a principal occupation who has successfully completed a registered apprenticeship program who works for the number of years required to establish industry projections for the occupation. Usually the term may also refer to mentor, technician, specialist, or other skilled worker who has documented sufficient skills and knowledge around within the occupation through practical on-the-job experience and formal training, 6A23-0217 Florida Administration Codes. 9. Jurisdiction means specifically geographical uh, geographical area with its particular program is registered 446-021-11 Florida Statutes. 10. On-the-job training, OJT, means the process of the apprenticeship for apprentice apprenticeship requires knowledge on the skills under supervision and tutelage of the experienced learning worker with the apprenticeship to occupation registered with the department on the job training, monitoring, monitoring training, and representative of the sponsor participating employer, 6A23-002-18 Florida Administration Code. All right, your ONET code is the Occupational Information Network code titles that are based on the system mandated by the Federal Office of Management and Budget using selecting statistical information on the occupation. 12. Participating employer means a business that need A that is actively engaged by though through its own employees in the actual work of the occupation being apprentice. B employees hire pays wages for the apprentice and the journey worker serving qualified training personnel training of the apprentice. C evaluates the apprentice and D is a signatory party of collective bargaining agreement or signatory to a participating employer agreement with a program sponsor which is registered with the department 6A23-0019. Food Administration Code. 13. Provisional registration means one year initial provision approval of the new register program that meets the required standard of the program registration program approval made by the permanent outline or permanent continued provisional resign 
following the review of the department is provided with the criteria prescribed in 6H13-0036, Florida Administration Code 6H13-0020, Florida Administration Code. 14. Registration agency means a registered state apprenticeship agency for the Department of Education that has responsibly registering apprenticeship program and apprentices providing technical assistance, conducting reviews of compliance, quality assurance, and assessments of federal purposes, 6 h Florida Administration Codes. 15. Related technical instruction means organized systematic form and instruction designed to provide apprentices with knowledge of the theoretical technical subjects related to the apprentice occupation, such as instruction may be given in the classroom throughout occupational industrial courses, correspondence courses, electronic media, other forms of self-study approved with the Department 6 h 25 Florida Administration Codes. 16. Sponsor means any person, association, committee, organization operating with an apprenticeship program whose name in the program is registered or approved 6 h 26 Florida Administration Code. 17. Work process means outline journey worker, supervised work experience, on-the-job training with allocation approximate hours to be spent in each activity. 6 h 232 Florida Administration Codes. Um, conformity with state and federal law. Standard apprenticeship will be conducted, operated, administrated, and conformed with the Apple provisions of Chapter 446, Florida State Statutes, Chapter 6, 6A23, Florida Administration Code, Title 29, Civil so Federal Regulations, Part 21, Title 29, Code Regulations, Part 30, all relevant and provides issued with the Florida Department of Education Presidentship Section, and use Department of Labor of the Office, uh, of, Office of Apprentice Support, the Veterans and Effective the Apprenticeship Act of 2019, Public Law 116, the one three four. The apprenticeship committee or sponsor attests that they will are aware of the available the education assistance of veterans, other individual eligible under Chapter 30 through 36 of the Title 38 United States Code with the connection with the registered apprenticeship program. Two will make good faith effort of the attaining approval of the educational assistance described in subparagraph one over the minimum each program location where the employees recruit veterans of the individual eligible for educational assistance under Chapter 30 through 36, Title 38 United States Code. 30. Will deny the application qualified candidate as who is a veteran or other individual eligible for the educational assistance of the, as described in subparagraph 1 for the purpose of avoiding making good faith effort over the obtained approval as described in subparagraph 2. These standards of apprenticeship to the extent of the practical will contain provisions granted advance to grant advance standing of the credit with the provided increased wages to compensate with the child for the standing of the, or credit for any veteran or other individual eligible education assistance under Chapter 30 through 36 of Title 38 United States Code. Code who one is enrolled in the registered apprenticeship program, two is has, one has demonstrated competency applicable with apprenticeship or occupation, or two has acquired experience training or skills through military service that applicable to the apprenticeship occupation. A copy of the executed standard apprenticeship standard apprenticeship appendix and certificate registration. Any future amendments to the standard apprenticeship will be forwarded to the Florida Department of Veterans Benefits Assistance Division, state approved by the agency bureau chief, 9500 Bay Pines Boulevard, Suite 214. Bay Pines, Florida 33714, Registration Apprenticeship Program. Senior Apprenticeship Program shall be submitted with the appropriate apprenticeship training representative to be reviewed forward to the department and, appro- for, and then and to be reviewed and forward to the department for approval registration upon approval by the Department of the Apprenticeship Program will receive one year provisional registration be issued a certificate of registration after the program is approved by made permanent continued or as a professional or regis- resigned following a review of the department such adherence of the standard apprenticeship and is found in Chapter 6 h F um, 003 Florida Administration Code. All right, Section 1, Program Administration Apprenticeship Committee. Program sponsors are responsible for the administration. All expect with the apprenticeship program. The sponsors are encouraged to establish a apprenticeship committee to carry out the responsibility duty of the required best ground and the standards of apprenticeship. As per t- um, 446-071-3, Florida statute, construction-related occupations must have the apprenticeship committee composed of member representatives of the participating employer. Use if the apprenticeship committee is established. If the apprenticeship committee shall be compromised with the representative of the participating employer, stakeholder, member, then current list must be provided with the body to the department. The apprenticeship committee shall include with the chairperson, secretary, of apprenticeship committee shall meet on a regular basis as often necessary in order to properly oversee the apprenticeship program. The apprenticeship committee will be composed of blank. No member or representative of the committee shall meet blank as often necessary to commit duck business. Use of no apprenticeship committee is established while Florida Department of Education highly recommended the program. You sponsor utilized services of the apprenticeship committee. The sponsor elected to administrate program without services of the apprenticeship committee. Responsibility of the sponsor. In addition to the sections outlined in standard apprenticeship, the sponsor will make a con- one make a concerted effort to continuous employment of the apprentice. 
and so far possible sufficient to afford the opportunity completion of the apprenticeship program and enable to fulfill the training or employment obligation conforms to the standard of apprenticeship um, the sponsor will and with the apprenticeship consent make the good faith effort to facilitate transfer of apprentice to another registered sponsor for completion of the apprentice to region arrange the periodic evaluation plans for review progress make recommendations as appropriate in general maybe the responsible successful operation program welfare apprentices and the welfare of apprentices responsibility of the apprenticeship committee if no apprenticeship committee move to number one and number two under responsibility of the sponsor additional responsibility of the sponsor of the allowing list responsibility apprenticeship committee one, notify that the appropriate apprenticeship training representative of all of the apprenticeship committee meetings to make available upon request official minutes of, of such meetings. Recommend changes of the program are deemed necessary to improve the effectiveness and efficiency. Section 2, responsibility for the apprentice. Uh, work faithfully digitally occupation while practicing safe work habit. 2, protect the property participating employer. 3, respect comply all rules, regulation, and policies of participating employer. And... Four, keep accurate records of work experiences, successfully complete all related technical instruction lessons, assignments, assessments as required, supplement properly completed records in a timely manner upon request. Section 3, funding, 6H23-0042X. Food administration goes, each participating employer will contribute to the equitable funding of the apprenticeship program as set by the apprenticeship committee or sponsor. Section 4, maintenance for the apprenticeship record, 6H23-0042FV. Full administration codes. All apprenticeship program court records pertaining to the administration, employment, training, and apprenticeship test scores, attendance record, transcript, and progress evaluation, etc. shall be sole maintenance responsibility of the sponsor kept at the following address, which are facility that allows that provides governmental access to the auditing process outlined in Chapter 119, Florida Statute, Florida Public law, re Records Law, name site, address site, and state, and zip code. All apprenticeship programs related to the records of the property of the sponsor must maintain for a period of no less than five years to the day the last action must be pre presented for a review when requested by the Department of Property Apprenticeship Training Representative. Section 5. Amendments, modifications, 6823037, Florida Administration Code, 6823042Q, Florida Administration Codes. These standards of apprenticeship may be amended and modified at any time of the apprenticeship committee or sponsor. Such amendment, the modifications must properly submitted with the Department of Approval through the appropriate apprenticeship training representative. If approved, the modifications or changes will be recorded. Acknowledgement in the 90 calendar days of the approval. If not approved, the apprenticeship committee and sponsor will be notified the reason. Therefore, provide appropriate assistance copy the amendment modifications adopted shall be furnished to each of representatives to whom amendments and modifications apply. Section 6, notification 6823-0042-R, full administration code. The department must be notified within 45 days through the appropriate apprenticeship training and uh, representative of all actions affecting the apprenticeship that is required apprenticeship action reporting form. Section 7, the program cancelization deregistration 6823-0061-B, Florida Administration Code. Um, cancelization of the program may be defective with the voluntary action and apprenticeship committee over the sponsor must notify the registration agency appropriate apprenticeship training representative within 45 days in writing of any decision to cancel the program. Deregistration program shall be upon written notice for the registrant agency to the apprenticeship committee and sponsor stating cause instituting formal deregistration proceeding in accordance with the provision of Chapter 6823006 Florida Administration Code. In either event, the apprenticeship committee and sponsor must notify all apprenticeships within 15 business days of the effective date that will deprive the apprenticeship of their individual registration. Section 8, Adjusting Differences, 6823-0082, Florida Administration Code, 6823-0422-TU, Florida Administration Codes. In case of dissatisfaction, participating employer or the apprentice has the right privilege to appeal for the apprentice committee response for the corrective action adjustment concerning these stands and or apprenticeship agreement with written notification received 30 days from the alleged dissatisfaction complaint shall be written signed with a complaint parent guardian if minor must include the name and address of the telephone number participating employer apprenticeship is involved with a brief description circumstance concerning the standard apprenticeship and the apprenticeship agreement the apprenticeship committee and sponsor will luckily make such running rulings as deemed necessary in each individual case within 30 days of receiving the written notification apprenticeship committee and sponsor will fully authorize authority to supervise enforcement of these standards and its decision 
will be finding binding of the participating employer and the apprentice. The department is available to consolidation interpretation to assist the resolve of the complaints of the participating employer or apprentice that has about the apprenticeship training program, the name and address of the appropriate authority to receive process, make disposition of the complaint, is name of the contact, address, city, state, and zip code, full name, and an email address. Participating employer apprenticeship should be the notification and apprenticeship committee if it is not less than five business days of the date of proposed adverse action stated opportunity for the participating employer apprenticeship during such period of corrective action for issues covered in the collective bargaining agreement apprenticeship must seek resolution through applicable procedures contained in the collective bargaining agreement if applicable. Section 9, Supervision and Apprenticeship Within Hours of Work, 6823-00421, Ford Administration Code. No apprentice shall work w without adequate, proper supervision, a fully qualified journey worker who is responsible for making working assignments, providing on-the-job training, ensuring safety at the work site. Adequate, proper supervision and apprenticeship does not mean apprentice must be within eyesight or reach of the, of the uh, apprentice of the journey worker, but the journey worker knows the apprentice is working on is readily available to do the apprenticeship and is making sure that the apprentice is necessary instruction and guidance to perform the task safely, correctly, and efficiently. Apprenticeships will generally work the same hours and full proficient work hours as journey workers, except that there is no apprenticeship will be allowed to work overtime if it interferes with the tens of related technical instruction and coursework. Section 10, Assurance of a Qualified Training Personnel, 6823 4 n at Florida Administration Code. Every instructor related for technical instruction apprentice must meet the Department Requirements of Career Technical Instructor per Section 101255 Florida State Statute or be subsequent matter expert who individually recognized by the industry as an expertise in the specific occupation and demonstrated being a journey, by being a journey worker or hold the license certification required to be given the occupation. All instructors must have the training techniques teaching techniques, adult learning styles, which must occur before the apprenticeship instructor has started to provide related technical instruction. Section 11 of the Apprenticeship Agreement, 6823-0042K, Food Administration Codes, Apprenticeship and Apprenticeship Committee shall sign the Apprenticeship Agreement, which shall set forth in terms of condition employment and training, shall meet the requirements of them be registered with the Department prior to signing the Apprenticeship Agreement. The selected applicant will give the opportunity to read and review standard apprenticeship additional written records policy with the sponsors. The Department must be notified in 45 days of the execution of each apprenticeship agreement. Section 12, credit for the previous experience, 623 l Florida Administration Code of the Apprenticeship Committee participating employer response may grant credit toward the term of the apprenticeship of the new apprentice. Credit will be based on demonstrating previous skills and knowledge. Who will identify with the occupation standard of apprenticeship of the department must be advised of the grant of any credit granted and wage ratio wage rate to which the advanced pre apprentice advanced. Our apprentice with the application seeking credit um, for previous experience must submit to the firm search records, affidavit, and other verifi verifiable documents such as, but not limited to the DD214 educational transcript, industry certification, etc., where to substantiate claim of credit. Request of credit will be evaluated and determined made by the apprenticeship committee, participating employer spo or sponsor during the program period, probationary period. Prior to completion of the probationary period, the amount of credit will to be awarded will be determined after review of the apprenticeship worker training education record evaluation apprenticeship performance demonstrated skill and knowledge during the probationary period, notwithstanding compliance to support veterans' effect of the Apprenticeship Act of 2019, the decision award, not award, how much credit to award. Is at the sole discretion of the apprenticeship committee participating employer or sponsor and apprenticeship grant credit credit will advance to the wage rate and related technical instruction level to compensate for the amount of credit awarded. Grant credited for previous experience must be uniformly applied to all apprenticeships. However, to ensure the consistency of the standard of apprenticeship, the department recommends that the crediting award procedure incorporate at a minimum the following basic requirements. A. Highly recommended no more than 50% of the apprenticeship program duration should be awarded under the apprentice transferring from an, another registered apprenticeship program in the same occupation. B. All credit credit granted more than grant credit granted for, of more than 1,000 hours of the on-the-job training will require evaluation method of shall include considerization time work specific close related occupation. A variance to uniformly apply credit award procedure may be granted when requested by the apprenticeship committee participating employer sponsors along the variance request does not undermine the quality of apprenticeship training variance flavors of the apprentice. 
Section 13, Safety Health Training, 6A, 23, uh, Florida Administration Codes, all principals receive the instruction safe health work practices both on job and related technical instructions that are in compliance with the Occupational Safety Health Administration standards promulgated by the Secretary of Labor in Title 29, U.S. Standard Code 65110, sequences amended same standards that have been found to be at least, effect, um, be at least as effective as the federal standards. Section 14. Transfer of an apprenticeship to training obligation 6A 230042M Florida Administration Codes. It should be the duty and responsibility of the apprenticeship committee and sponsor to provide insofar as possible continuous employment for all apprenticeships where it is impossible for one employer to provide a diversity of the experience necessary to give the apprenticeship total training experience of the various branches of the occupation or where the employer business is such a character and is not per reasonably continuous employment over the entire period of the apprenticeship. The apprenticeship committee sponsor shall authority to transfer the apprenticeship with another participating employer shall assume that all credits, terms, and conditions of the standards Appropriates must receive full credit satisfactory time and training earned. Should an apprentice be transferred from one registered apprenticeship program to another, the apprenticeship must be provide transcripts of completed related technical instructions as well as the completed on the job training originating sponsor. Transfer apprenticeship must be in the same occupation. The apprenticeship must be canceled for the originating sponsor program. New apprenticeship agreement must be executed between the apprenticeship subsequent program sponsors registered with the registration agency. Section 15, Certificate Completion of the Apprenticeship Program, 6A, 23 Florida Administration Codes. Upon satisfactory completion of the apprenticeship program by apprenticeship is established in these standards of the apprenticeship. Apprenticeship Committee sponsor will certify the department requests awarding certificate completion of the apprenticeship to completing apprenticeship issued by the department. The following sections can also be found in the appropriate employer occupational index. All right, 16 uh, terms of apprenticeship training approach 6A23 0042B for C. Uh, 2B, Florida Administration Code, the term of apprenticeship should include approximate extended length of the apprenticeship in hours and months, not include, including probationary period. Apprenticeship training approach may include the time based, competency based, hybrid based, and if the sponsor employed with the competency based, hybrid based approach of the apprenticeship training may incorporate career lattice issuing interim credentials as pathway of the apprenticeship to vertic move vertically horizontally through the apprenticeship training. Section 17, probationary period, 6A23002, uh, sorry, 6A23004-2H, Florida Administration Code, 6A23004-2S, Florida Administration Code. Apprenticeships will employed under the standard shall be subject to the probation period, without, uh, which cannot exceed 25% of the length of the program or one year, whichever is shorter during the probationary period. The apprentice, uh, apprenticeship agreement may be determined by either party upon written notice to the department appropriate apprenticeship training represented without cause. Any probationary apprentice evaluated in satisfactory review of the probation period will be given them full credit for over the probationary period continuing with the apprenticeship program. Cancelization during the probation period will not have a diverse effect on the program sponsor completion rate. Section 18, Ratio of the Apprentices, 6A, 23004-2G, Florida Administration Code. Our apprenticeship committee sponsor participating employers shall have the numeric ratio of the during workers for the proper supervision, training, safety, and continuity of the employment of provision, collective bargaining agreements, except the type of the ratio successfully prohibited by collective of the bargaining arrangements should be performed by the apprenticeship committee sponsor to ensure that the allowable the ratio of apprenticeship the during workers consistently maintained in the program as whole by each participating employer on the job site. Ratio apprenticeship during workers is contingent whether the occupation is in construction, non construction related industry. If the apprenticeship the occupation is non construction related industry, a variance may be requested to sponsor approved by the department. Section 19, Qualification Selection Procedures, 6A23 0042J, Florida Administration Code, Title 29, CFR 3010. Minimum qualification required sponsor persons entering an apprenticeship agreement where it must have the eligible starting age not less than 16 years age. The apprenticeship committee of the sponsor may elect to require a minimum age above 16 age years. Apprenticeship committee participating employer or sponsor, whichever is appropriate, may utilize the method of selecting apprenticeship to provide the selection method one comply with the uniform guidelines employee selection procedure, Title 41 CFR Part 63. Two uniformly consistently applied to all applicants and impression. Apprentices 3 complied with the Title 180A EEOC Implementation Regulations Part 1630. Selection procedure must not screen out or tend to screen out other individuals with a, dis with a disability or class of individuals with a disability on basis of disability unless the standard test or other selection criteria is used to the program sponsor shown the job related position question consistent with a business necessity, facility neutral in terms of race, color, religion, national origin, sex, sexual orientation, age, 40 or older, genetic information or disability. 
Veterans who have received a discharge other than dishonorable discharge shall be qualified. Receive the same priorities given to the registered pre-apprentice. Selection records must be kept for at least five years. The apprenticeship committee participating employer sponsor, whichever is appropriate, may reinstate affirmative uh, um, reinstate apprentices previously registered in two years of the date of cancelization without requiring individuals to take application meet minimum qualification advanced through selection process. Section 20, Affirmative Action Equal Opportunity, 6823-0042-Y, Florida Administration Code, Title 29 CFR 30.3, and Title 29 30.4. Permission Committee and Sponsor acknowledge it will adopt the Affirmative Action Plan in accord with the Florida State Plan of Equal Opportunity uh, in Registered Apprenticeship Training. Recruitment, selection, employment, the training, apprenticeship, the training due to the apprenticeship shall be without discriminatory race, race, color, religion, national origin, sex, including pregnancy, gender, identity, sexual orientation, genetic information, or because of the individual disability or person with 40 years or older. Section 21. All right. Um, testing. Section 21, Worker Process Related Technical Instructions, 6823-0042-CD, Florida Administration Codes. During the apprenticeship, the apprenticeship will receive the on-the-job training in all three of the occupational necessary to develop skills, expertise, skill of the joint worker, and the outline appropriate to the employer occupational appendix. Every apprenticeship is required to participate related technical instruction related with the occupations outlined in is an appropriate employer occupation. At least 144 clock hours of related technical instruction is recommended each year apprenticeship and where apprenticeship is enrolled in college credit courses, three credit course hours, lecture lab credit hour is recommended for each year of apprenticeship. Section 22. Apprenticeship wage schedule 623-0042E. Apprenticeships must be progressively increasing scheduled wages based on currently established joining worker hourly wage. The apprenticeship wage may not be less than 35% of the uh, established joining worker rate during the first period and not less than 75% in the last period. In no event should the apprenticeship wage be less than minimum wage prescribed in federal or state law. For an apprentice to advance the next segment of the training fully proficient joining worker status, the sponsor will evaluate all progress to determine whether the advancement has been earned by satisfactory performance on the job or related technical instruction and courses. Apprenticeship journey worker hourly wage rate should be reviewed annually and amended when determined by apprenticeship committee sponsor or per collective bargaining agreement. Section 23, participating employers are um, 6823-0042-W, Florida Administration Code. Participating employers shall sign a participating employer agreement with the apprenticeship committees or sponsors accepting the funding formula or other requirements of the standard apprenticeship unless... Otherwise, providing collective bargaining agreement, apprenticeship committee, and sponsors shall provide an execute copy of signed participating employer agreements to the department through the appropriate apprenticeship training representative. The apprenticeship committee and sponsors shall notify the department on a current basis of any change in the status of each participating employer within the program. Artificial adoption apprenticeship stands with the committee program sponsor for address, phone number, email, F E I N F Apple N A I C S. Code chairman, date, secretary, date, um, committee members, chairperson, secretary, uh, signature authority from the committee name and title, name, type and print, signature and title, affiliation reviewed by apprentice training representative blank, Florida Department of Education Division of Career Adult Education Authorized Fiscal Registration Agency. Official adoption and appreciation stands without committee. Program sponsor address, phone number, email address, F E I N, applicable N A I C. Here it up, standard apprenticeship on the date of blank, um, 2020. Signature pro program sponsor title and affiliation printed name. Reviewed by apprenticeship standard training representative date. Florida Department Division of Career uh, Adult Education Apprenticeship Authorized Official Registration Agency date. And that was a brief reading of Standards of the Apprenticeship Division, Career Technical and Adult Education Apprenticeship Section, uh, Florida Department of Education.